As the biggest team in parkour, Store has seen its fair share of wins and fails. Because Store's fail video was taken down and the closest thing on YouTube is a poorly made reaction video, let us review each Store member's worst fail. Don't miss out on this opportunity to learn from the best and grow in your parkour journey. Sasha's leg injury. From research seems that he broke it during a Store water challenge, Store didn't put it on YouTube because of YouTube's guidelines, but it can be found as a member only video. This injury caused him to not train as often from what we could see in the new videos. All of that is substantial. The truth is, Sasha got a leg injury, and the rest is inferred. Toby's hand slide cat pass fail. He says this is his most painful bail, and later after doing a plyo challenge slipped a disc, which he thinks was caused by this failure. Toby also overdid this dive kong, not feeling any pain after landing. Joss's incredible bail. The craziest thing I have ever seen, although not sure if it would be his worst fail. Thank you, Josh, for taking the safer route. Callum's disastrous slip. He headbutted the wall in front of him and forgot everything. His memory was terrible, he threw up and destroyed his back. The back injury is still prolonged to this day. Benj's double gainer to back. Even though water breaks or fall, it always hurts to land wrong. From this height, Benj felt like he had been hit by a bus. With the help of the people around him, Benj got out safely. This destroyed his lungs to the point he couldn't go on an airplane. These next two may be hard to watch. Skip to the last chapter for a treat. Max's neck to concrete. Because of the wet conditions, his foot slipped causing him to land on his head, and he blacked out for close to 30 seconds. A Max jump was comfortable with destroyed him because of a single change in conditions. Max was brought to the hospital and put into an induced coma. And lastly, Drew's broken ankle. This truly shows you that something can happen any time in parkour. The pain felt was immense, and later Drew is smiling and knows it can't get worse. His rehab was perfect and Drew is himself again, showing the incredible skills and unwavering dedication the store athletes have. How do we learn from these failures? We can learn that failure or mistakes are bound to happen and something can happen at any given moment. But if we learn from these failures, we grow and become better. The store members have become masters at conditioning all possibilities instead of hoping they won't happen. This ensures all training is as safe as possible. Also, link in bio to an archive of stores video. And remember, the future of parkour is here. It's time to join the revolution.